Okay, so what's going on now? Huh. Oh, it looks like something's blocking the way. Fuck, 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 fuck! Maybe we could walk? That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm just saying. Hmm, I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. That thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. You gotta get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. He has a this point. Shit. This. Yo, you we keep can move it. like that, and you're gonna get your face chewed off. Are you guys gonna be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. Looks like we've met some new people. No, we're friendly. Put your hand down, kid. That's what everybody says. We know. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. We might Anything be able to drive. Up there. We won't let them escape. We might be able to drive um the tank away. I don't know. Okay. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now. What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're driving it. <laughs> oh, man. <coughs> oh, excuse me, guys. Um... Look, you want to help us out? We could use some able bodies and... Yeah, we, we really need some help. What's in it? Oh, shit! God damn, you guys have a kid! Really, Clementine? What, are you, what are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Well, this is great! See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? Um... I came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened. We've been together ever since. And everybody down there, they're cool? Um... We just met Chuck, but he seems like an alright guy. You always have to worry about new people. I used to love meeting new people. That must have been a long time ago. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. That train is awesome, though. That tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it. But if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We'd appreciate the help. You can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. Okay, so I guess we can look at all the stuff up here it's first. Um, anything useful back here? There's looks like duct tape or something on the floor. That's about the only useful thing in here. <laughs> yeah. Empty. That's what I figured. Okay. Looks like it's been ransacked anyways. Um There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Okay. Um Is there anything else we can do over here? I don't think so. Whatever government work was going on here didn't seem to help. Okay. So we're just gonna have to head back down and see what the plan's gonna be. Let's go talk to your people, man. Oh me. What? Alright, let's go. Guys, this is Omid and Krista. Not big on welcomes. Like <laughs> I said, we could use some good people. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we're not looking for charity. We could help you guys, though. 
The plan is to cut that tanker down and be on our way. Like plan enough to me. You want to start in on that tanker? I'll get to know the girl for a minute, if you don't mind. And why don't I show you how this thing works, in case something happens. Really, Ken? It's probably for the best. Someone might want to have a look inside of that station back there, too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. Oh, Ken is so depressed right now. It's horrible. It's like the depression just transferred from Lily to Ken. Like, we're losing a family member and stuff. I don't know what that does yet. Don't touch it. I said don't touch it, jackass. <laughs> Um, how have you two made it this far? You seem dangerously normal. Krista doesn't let us join groups, and I'm a fucking scrapper. I got the feeling she takes care of you. Please, I've saved her ass hundreds, tens, sometimes. <laughs> I guess not. How long since you've been home? Like six months. We were on the road for a while, and then, you know, that's rough. Her cat is going to be pissed. Learning the ropes? Can't be too hard, right? There are a lot of levers I can't wait to use. I said if something were to happen to me, maybe we can drive in shifts. We'll see. Talk to you later. Okay. Um, I guess Teaching we can talk to Kenny. Trying to. Okay. Is there anything else we can do? Anyone else we can speak to? Maybe? All right, let's just go down this way. Um, I hope it. I'm glad someone's managed to keep the spirit. I hope I'm not gonna get copyrighted for the guitar playing because, oh no. Got a him. clear view up there? Yeah, we're good for a ways. Thank God. We need someone, anyone, to come along and and exterminate them or something. Um. Toughen up. It's you, me, and now Chuck. Who knows what these new people have planned? There are gonna be a lot more walkers to take care of. That's what I'm afraid of. I'm telling you, Lee. If they ever get a hold of me, and I know I'm not getting out of it, that's it, man. I'm just gonna punch my own ticket. Punch your own ticket? Yeah. Take myself out. Don't be dramatic. <laughs> not don't be dramatic. And don't let them get a hold of you. Period. That's literally it. Okay. Um, where is Clementine? Can we not go that way? I guess not. So where's Clementine and the... I don't see them anywhere. Okay, I guess we can go to the station or whatever. This would create one hell of a fireball if we Oh, they're behind them. us. <laughs> I just realized. Okay. You interrogating this woman for us? Yep. She set off any alarm bells? Not yet. She's very thorough. That's what I like to hear. Okay. We're gonna go to the train station and see what we can, can find I you over there. You don't like the new girl? I do, but it's like we're a team, like you said. Yeah. All right. Come on. Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. I hope it's safe to take her with us. Survivors inside. Oh, no. Then that means there might be walkers in there. Somebody must have been pretty desperate. That paint has been dry for months. Oh, jeez. I hope. I 
I just hope we don't get any, I don't know, I hope we don't have any issues because without saying survivors inside, that probably means that people are in there and of course they're not alive anymore, so there might be walkers in there. You should wait for me before trying to open doors. Sorry. Uh, luckily it's locked. We'll get better at working together. All right, can we pick the lock? Maybe. I guess we're just gonna push. Mm, old bird. Um. I guess we probably have to go around or something. Doesn't look like that thing's worked in years. Okay. Nothing else we can do, really. Okay. Um, since that's not breaking. Oh wait, is something we'll up in find there? A way in. Okay. We might have to the windows open up there. Maybe I could look in. That's true. Why don't I put you on my shoulders and you can peek into that window up there? Sounds good. <laughs> Alright. Let us know what you see, Clementine. Okay, I can see in. What do I do now? Um. What do you see? Lots of crates and stuff. Maybe we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock, which actually might work now that we have the time. I think I opened it. For real? I think so. Hopefully, there's no walkers in there. It didn't seem like she saw any walkers in there, so. Well, I'll be damned. Okay, let's go in. Let's go. Be careful. I'm supposed to tell you that. <laughs> I was just about to say that. Okay. Hopefully we find something good. God damn, it's dark in here. Maybe I can hold the door open? I don't like that. I'll prop it open with something. Okay. Get one of those crates. Um. Oh wait, hold on. It's too dark in there. Yeah, we should prop the door open with something. I clicked on the wrong thing. Let's go back inside. It's way too dark. Yeah, you're right. Okay, give me a second. We're gonna use this to prop it open. Beautiful. All right, let's look around. Locked up good. <sighs> Does that I mean someone might come back? Because everything is locked up, and it was locked up from inside. So, I don't know. Can't reach him from here. So how are we gonna get to the key? <laughs> Um, we're gonna have to speak to Clementine again. How we doing? Good. What do we need? Something to help us deal with the tanker out there. Okay, she could not help us this time. Um, is there something? Oh, wait. There's some space up there, but not much. We're lucky I'm so little. Yeah, we are. Well, it's a good thing we brought her with us then. You okay going over the top of this fence? Yeah, definitely. Hopefully there's nothing behind. Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Come on, scoot. Uh-oh. Behind you! Oh, no. Fuck! Oh. Oh, no. Grab the gun. Grab the gun. Grab the gun. Um... Uh, we can't, we can't use our hands. Oh, Dale. <laughs> I need to. Go on and grab the keys, Clem. 
Uh oh. Come on. Scoot. Come on, Clem. Come on. She's seen Behind something. You. All right, shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh. Ah. <gasps> uh, okay, we need to get that. All right, head back, head back, head back. Come on, come on, grab it. Go for him first. Oh no. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We got this, we got this, we got this. Here we go. At least we didn't have to use um the gun as well to bring noise in, which is great. Oh, bless her heart. It's okay, it's okay. Everything's fine. Oh, she couldn't shoot. She couldn't do it. Oh no, there's one in there. Oh no. Keys, now! Quick. Open, open. Fuck, it's still locked. Oi, what did I do? I hope that sound doesn't bring anyone by. God damn. That didn't go so good. No, it did not go so good. But we're okay. Everything's okay. Hopefully that wasn't too What's loud. What's going on? I thought I heard a gunshot. We're fine. <laughs> we found some walkers. You and an eight-year-old versus three of them, huh? We did that. <laughs> we handled it. Yeah, it looks like. What if you hadn't? I'm gonna go make sure the noise didn't cause us any problems. That's a good idea. I don't like her attitude. We don't need another Lily in this group, okay? I hope you know what you're doing with her. Me too. For her sake. People need to just stop. Like, second, I don't know how to say it. They need to just stop not trusting us. <laughs> Why do we okay. think we have we her outside now? What did we learn? I'm not ready for a gun. No, Clem. We learned that everything we will ever do is dangerous. We'll get better, smarter, and faster, okay? Okay. I don't know why everyone just thinks we're not gonna um take care of Clem like why would why would we take like why would we help her from the beginning if we were never going to take care of her I'm trying to understand that make it make sense <laughs> you sure you're okay yeah I'm a little shaky it'll pass all right let's head out I found a blowtorch in the station. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Excellent. I'll come up there with you to have a look. Okay. Let's go. Hopefully this works, because I don't, I don't see any other options. No gas. A hose has a leak in it. Turn it off, dude. I, I don't want my eyebrows burned off. Better plug that leak with something. Oh, we've got the um the tape. <laughs> I knew there was a reason why we found the tape. Hope this holds. Alright, let's try this again. That's crazy. Look at it go. Just about got it. Thanks. No sweat, man. 
This thing is hanging by a thread. The smallest cut and it'll go. I can't reach it now. So how are we gonna do this? It's too far off the edge. So what now? <laughs> um I don't know. Do we have to do something here maybe? Maybe we're gonna have to head back down. Let's talk to him and see if he has any ideas. Think this'll work? Dude, you're cutting metal with fire. How could it not? Okay, that wasn't really helpful. Here, the weak portion of the coupling's out of my reach. You think it'll be within mine? <laughs> no, but I'm gonna dangle you over that ledge. The hell you are! <laughs> God, he says, you're a real son of a bitch, aren't you? Shut up and start cutting. <laughs> oh my goodness. That is a lot. That is a lot of them. Guys, there's something coming. What the what? There must be thousands. We gotta go. Okay. Oh me. Hurry God, up, hurry God. up. I am! It's going! Pull me up! Can he go? Let's move it, move it, move it. Shit! What the hell do we do now? Um... We need to blow it up. Oh, to God, this works. Holy crap! At least it will burn the. We gotta jump. What? No way. Guy, if you wanna stay there, stay there. But I'm jumping. <laughs> Guys. Jump. No. Jump, damn it. Still no. Fine. I'm gonna have to. Ugh. Come on, jump, jump. Please jump. Okay. Ah. Oh, jeez. Get up. Come on. I thought the fire would have um stopped them a little. Let's grab him. Okay, come on. No, come on, Krista. Her, not me. Krista, no! Oh no. Fuck! You piece of shit! She's a woman! Don't you know? <laughs> uh, baby. It's okay, honey. I'm okay. <sighs> you had the broken leg. I figured she'd be able to jump on herself. Like Oh no. I thought the fire would have been able to stop the It didn't that blow up. Was a lot of them. Are you hurt? No. We're okay. Speak for yourself. My leg is fucked. We're fine, Clementine. We're fine. I was hoping it'd blow up a bit more than that, because it barely even stopped them from coming. But at least we've broken past that hurdle. Uh, what's gonna happen now? I don't know. Wait, who did she? Is that? Is that Lee? Oh no, I think that's um, Kenny. Oh, Kenny and his family. That's so sad. Next stop, the Atlantic. We have to find a boat. We just have to. Like, but what are they gonna do though once they get on the boat in the middle of nowhere? You'll never get over today. That's all I keep thinking. Try to think about what's ahead of you. That's why I keep thinking it. I'll leave you to your thoughts. 
She's out cold like I've never seen. Savannah Clementine. I got your parents right here, and you be sure to find me whether Lee wants you to or not. Now, what I need. Holy shit. She's been speaking I to somebody. That fucking thing was broken. So did I. Well, it sounds like somebody knows where we're headed. This is not oh, good. Fuck. I don't know, but I doubt we're going to be happy when we find out. They do not sound like good people. Oh no. Oh, I think when she was like, can I tell my parents? I think she meant with the walkie talkie, not like tell her parents that who Lee was. I got that confused. Oh, damn. Damn. Next time on The Walking Dead. We're almost at the river. You want to get on a boat? Or you want to wait around till the walkers figure out we're here? We need to focus on finding the boat right now, Claire. Like we talked about on the train. I don't know how much longer he can keep on like this. If his leg gets any worse, we're gonna have to carry him. Or leave him. If I were you, I'd get out of the street. Now! Who the hell is this? Answer me, damn it! So when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Who have you been talking to? You oh, come geez. back here, I'll kill you. You understand? I will kill you! <sighs> damn i don't know so this episode was a lot yeah um i don't know what's gonna happen i don't know yeah i don't know who she's been speaking to on the radio i thought you know i thought when she said can i tell my parents i thought she meant like can she tell her parents that you know lee was a criminal like he was getting arrested I didn't realize she meant like, can I tell my parents I'm coming to meet them in Savannah right now on the radio? I completely forgot about the radio, but I guess they know now, they know now. So we're going to see. Hopefully they're friendlies when we get there. I doubt they are because the way they were sounding, it was sounding kind of creepy. So yeah, um, let's just go through the choices. Did you shoot the girl in the street? So you're on 40% of players shot her. So quite a lot of people didn't actually. More people didn't shoot her, so maybe I shouldn't. <laughs> um, maybe we would have been able to get more stuff if we didn't shoot her. But, um, did you abandon Lily? You and fifty-five percent of players didn't abandon her, which is good. Did you fight Kenny? So you and fifty-five percent of players fought him. Did you shoot Duck? Yeah, a lot of people shot Duck. Wow, I'm surprised. I thought not a lot of people would. And did you help Omid? You and 60% of players helped Omid. Yeah, because he, he was hurting. Like, he it would make more sense to help him first and then help her. And if, obviously, we didn't have the choice to help her next. But she was able to get on the train because, you know, she was healthy. But, yeah. um, The walking dead, long road ahead. So, yeah, that's everything for the video for this part um i hope you guys enjoyed episode three um of course if you've seen it before please don't ruin it in the comment section um if you've played it before as well don't ruin it in the comment section you know i try i want to stay as surprised as i can as i'm going through the episodes and stuff but yeah thank you guys for watching thank you for sticking with me through this um vlog mess slash game mess <laughs> idea of mine hopefully at this point i'm still staying on top of things in terms of recording and posting for you guys and i hope you guys are enjoying the content that i'm putting out there for you make sure you like comment and subscribe to the channel and leave a comment on what other games you like to see on this channel and yeah thank you for watching bye guys stay safe and peace out